load. Hey guys, this is Bastion from NC, and I'm doing a video of me at my lake house with my brother, my dad, and uh, so far the trip has not been going too well. We've had boat problems, like our entire motor broke with oil. Was that a bottle rocket? Was that, did, was that a bottle rocket? Okay. Yeah, we've had problems with the um, uh, oil and everything. So we just got that repaired today, and thought I'd go ahead and start the video. I found a dead shad. I just wanted to show like a match the hatch type of thing. Bottle rocket. Um, kind of match the hatch kind of stuff. So that's that's what we're gonna be fishing. They're biting shad right now. So there's a. So I'm just gonna throw that back because it's kind of nasty. It's all smelly. <laughs> bottle rockets all right well yeah this is what i'm gonna be fishing we've heard some rumors of i think a seven pound bass right off the bridge and that's right where we're gonna go fish and they were fishing live minnows but i don't i'm not really into that so i got this fake minnow right here so we're about to head out Alright guys, we just got here, and I just wanted to quickly say what I was fishing. I got a uh, that shad you guys already saw. I got a small spinner bait and a uh, bluegill colored football jig. This is a lot of rocks around here, and the bass that were known to be really big were up there. But uh, we got, might as well start. Was that top water feed? Yeah, it's top water. Some top water right there. Um, film there for a second. Yeah, I yeah. Well, I think it was just shad, but uh. We're gonna go ahead and start here, so uh, get back to you guys when we catch a fish. Dad just got one on a panther. It's not very big. Oh! Oh, all right. Didn't have to all right, take well, him off. Well, yeah. He had a bigger one on, possibly like a two pounder. What do you think? Probably about that. Yep. This spot has some big fish, so yeah, he had a panther martini. Said that little one. Got it that time. It's just a little one. Still a very healthy fish. Yeah. Nice. Oh, what do you right think there. about that, Dad? Woo! Mm -hmm. like it. Right They're really liking this uh, Panther Martin right now. All right, let's get. Let's get. Reliable. Go get your bigger brother. No. Stuck. Maybe. All right, back with another fish on the. Oh no, he fell off. I gotta get him. I gotta get him. No. That was such a fail. All right, well, I got the camera out because um, that was a, it was small, but he put up a really good fight and he was really fat. Look for oh, his so size. Back, he was, he was, he was fat. really fat, so that was what I was getting at. But uh, here, I'll show you guys what I'm using. Uh, if I can find it, he shook the hook right off. What? What, Dad? Big top water or? What, it was like your fish that came shooting out of the water. I think another fish was going after him. Yeah, green beetle spin and uh, lots of top water. So, Jack just got a little black warm out. I caught some. I might put a picture at the end. I don't know. I just thought about that. But uh, you can tell by the sky, it's about time we got to go, unfortunately. Just started fishing a spook and. Um, yeah, I was really excited about that. We might have a little bit more time to fish, 
but it's but we just saw lightning and as soon as we as soon as rain starts we need to hurry up and get back so uh warm out here jack run it over here real well yeah okay yeah that's the same type i call a little black warm out here a little black dot right there you can yeah. tell it's a warm out all right well and if you can hold on. um I might do some dock fishing. Oh, I'm let him go. I might do some dock fishing. So, uh, are you guys gonna join me for that? Yeah, you guys? Yeah. All right, then. I guess we'll get back to you once we're at the dock. So, yeah. All right, guys. So, um, don't think there's gonna be any dock fishing. We just had a huge storm. This is nothing compared to what it was just like. We are all soaked. Like, which everybody is just awful. I mean, our whole boat is soaked. I mean, it's still fun. We caught some fish. It wasn't awful, but you know. I stand. I hold the record for the last yeah. fish. Yeah, he got the warm mouth. Let's go find a cat. Oh, there's a cat. There's a little cat right there. So, um, I think we're gonna get up early and go fish, and hopefully the storm will have made that some better fishing. And I will. I will record that. Yeah, I'll stir up the crayfish, so like a jig, stuff like that. that All right. right so easy? I think I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, we're back and it's about 6 in the morning and we're going to fish topwater at this spot known as One Bush. And you can't really see it right now, but it's just a single bush in the water and there's a topwater. It's actually really active here. Like, they are eating a lot of shad, so that's what we're going to try to... There's just three, like, really instant. Or, that's what they're eating around here, so we're going to try to do some shad stuff. So, yeah. Uh, we moved to the bridge because one bush wasn't having luck. First cast, my dad just caught a white bass. That thing was fighting for a really long time, and it's, it's not that big, but first cast, we moved to the bridge. Uh, what was that, Panther Martin? Panther Martin. Nice job. Thank you. There white, you go, ba white bass. White bass really like top water, too, so if they're around here, we could throw like a popper or something, but see you guys on the next fish. Jack got one mm -hmm. off. Uh, uh, what'd you get it off? It was off a squirrel, squirrel tail, tail Panther rooster, Martin thing. Rooster tail. Nice. Yeah. Well, and uh, recently started using this jointed Lenny, and they're attacking it. So probably yeah, I don't think we'll they know back. what Lenny is. Yeah, Lenny is uh, this this. I'll, I might do a different video on it. It's a jointed Rapala crankbait. All right, I'm gonna let this dude go. He's a shallow diver. Whoa, Whoa. we got an extra jump out of him. Air, right, air yep. time. Me and Jack just doubled up. Um, they're really feeding around here. Jack, will you grab mine? I got yeah. a bass and he got a white bass. Yeah. So, um, uh, yeah. we got them in the live well. We're going to keep them in there until my dad hey, catches cut one. Off the water, the catches water. one so that, uh, we all get, you know, fish. Come here. Is it closed? Yeah, it's closed. It was just a baby. Yes. Got yours. Thank you. Yeah, no, hold them like that so I can flip them. Thank you. It's a nice bass. Jointed, uh, Rapala crankbait. I'll probably do a separate video and explain what Lenny I'm is. I'm still using that squirrel tail. I told you guys about that. He's, he's pretty fat. He's kind of oh, small. Right. He has a small mouth. White mass. bass. I'm using and that squirrel tail. White bass. All right, so. Yep. Dad to just had quick. one, but it got off. All right, so we're going to get a quick picture and then we'll keep them in the live well till we all get them. All right, so. Yeah. Got. My dad just got a really nice one. Man, was he fighting. Yeah, he, he used the he net on I had to get the net on this guy. Yeah, um, hopefully we can catch a bigger one. They're really, yeah, really good right now. Panther right. Martin. Um, our fish are still in the live well. We'll probably try to get a picture of all of our fish. There's some feeding out. over there. So, uh, yeah. Panther Martin, right, you said? Panther Martin. All right, yep. Oh, yep, they're feeding, look. So, whenever that... All of that happens you're feeding on shad, so you just cast over there and you get one. So yeah. actually, I'm setting this guy for you on the video. Yep. Wait, no, no, keep it so we can get a picture. Put oh. it in the live while we're foot. All right. Oh my gosh! One of those fish just jumped all the way out of the live well and landed back in. That was crazy. All right, so um, yeah, we'll be back one with another fish. Another one on that squirrel tail. Yep, Jack got one. 
And uh, yeah, I haven't really caught that many recently. I put on some stuff that didn't really this swim. Guy was, right. This guy was jumping and then I cast it right to it. And he got it. Wanna so, let him go? Uh, I wanna get a picture it's with the other ones. Small though. Yeah. Here, take a picture. Here, wait. Yeah, you gotta move your tackle box. Oh, well, that means to turn off. Yeah. If you can find the white bass. I think that's him right there. He's the one. No, that's not him. Yeah, they're all over here. There he is. Oh, no, that's the big, the big one. one. But I do. Sorry, guys. Jack splashed the camera with water. All right, he got the striped uh, white bass and the... Oh, a little large mouth. You gotta let I, him go? Yeah. Or, well, actually, let's have everyone grab their fish. And we can set the camera on something. <laughs> Alright, you gotta move. You can't be there, though. You gotta move back to the back. Oh, you let him go? <laughs> Alright, yeah. Alright, well, there goes the big go. Yeah, there goes the big one. Alright, these two dudes. Adios, my amigos. Just set this guy free? Yeah, let's go. Is that all the fish in there or no? I think so. Wait, Dad, have you done your big one yet? Yeah. Was, okay. I brought him over the side as I was lifting. Oh, and then he uh, fell in. He was like. Alright, well, yep. Alright. Alright. Jack got one. Uh, it's a pretty nice one. It's fat. It's not huge, but you don't have to hold it that close because then we can't see it. Oh, I got a smudge on the camera. Hold on. Okay. There we go. All right, hold it here. It's a nice one. All right. All right, quick. Jack got another. Um, he got like, it off a crappy jig. Yeah, that's. I was gonna. Like not I was gonna a drop it down crappy for crappy. Or, Crappy or crappy? Yeah, but I was gonna drop it down. I thought I'd reel it in, so and I just fat. got this Here, dude like second cast. Turn around to see how fat it is. Not yeah, the he's other way. really fat. He's All right, let him go. All right.